What's up, y'all? It's your Leah back with another video. Long time no see, but I'm not gonna hold y'all too long for this video because it's a quick little lesson for people that are going to be selling their homes and you live in North Carolina. So first, I wanna say I am a North Carolina real estate broker and realtor. So if you guys wanna connect, go ahead and contact me down below. I will leave my information. I am with Costello Real Estate and Investments, so we'll be working with us. Also, please go ahead and comment and subscribe to the channel you know what i mean i'm really putting in a lot of work for these videos i'm trying to continue to provide value to you guys even though i'm deployed right now so yeah go ahead and subscribe to the channel you know what i mean i'm going to be posting videos very very frequently so don't ever miss an upload because it can save you some money so see my whiteboard and we're gonna pray that it doesn't fall off of the door keep in mind also i will be back home shortly okay so don't think just because i'm deployed that we can't work together because i'm gonna be home pretty soon and i'm going to make a video of when i come home so don't worry about that okay so let's go ahead and hop into this video so we can calculate this formula for you guys okay so north carolina excess tax so if you guys don't know what that is north carolina excess tax is basically the tax that you're gonna have to pay when you transfer your property so when i mean transferring your property i mean when you sell it to another person it's a tax that you have to pay unfortunately you know uncle sam gonna get his so let's go ahead and make sure that we can plan accordingly when it comes down to paying this tax so i'm gonna give you guys uh obviously i just gave you guys the definition with an example i'm gonna give you guys uh what the xx tax basically is which is you have to round up to the next 500 from the selling price so the selling price it could be uh $89,250, right? But you have to round to the nearest 500. So if you round to the nearest 500, that makes it go to $89,500. So that is the rounded selling price. So when you round that price, that is the price that you're going to have to use in order to calculate the formula. So the formula for this tax is selling price the rounded selling price divided by 500 and then multiplied by one so i understand that a lot of people are going to be like well you're still going to get the same price i understand but that's the best practice to use um multiplying by one because you never know the formula could come out different or the answer could come out different if you don't use one so just go ahead and use it you know what i mean that is a part of the formula so it just keep a best best practice and um you know do what the formula actually uh requires so an example of this still using our 89,500 rounded which is the selling pro the selling price to the nearest 500 the example would be the rounded price divided by 500 times one that's going to give us 179 dollars and i know that it's not a big amount but when you're selling your property, please understand that prices and different fees and things like that are going to add up. So it's the small things that add up at the end of the day. And you want to know where your money is going to, especially after you've lived in this home, you maybe have um, invested into this home. You want to be able to calculate your budget and calculate your finances accordingly that way that you can set yourself up in the best way possible. Again, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to go ahead and like, comment, subscribe to the channel. I hope this helped you guys figure out excess tax. If you guys want to connect with me, again, my name is Aaliyah M. Clark. I'm with Costello Real Estate Investment. You can go, real estate and investment, excuse me. You can go ahead and reach out to me down below. Uh, I should have my social medias posted below um, on the bottom of the screen. I really appreciate you guys for watching. More content is coming. Uh, apartment reviews, housing reviews. Um, I'm gonna be like literally anything that pertains to real estate will be getting posted on this channel. So thank you guys. I'm gonna be posting some real estate investing tips as well. So if you guys are interested in real estate investing, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Thank you guys again for watching and I'm gonna catch you guys in the next one.